Hey, John Case with Line Drive Nation. Hey, just a practice idea for coaches out there. So listen, we play this. We call it fungo ball. So it serves a couple purposes. We're really trying to get as many defensive situations as we can. And also, I think it's really important. I've, I've said this before and shown this before, but it's really important for for hitters to be able to hit fungo. Use their hands, you know, their barrel path. Um a lot of hitters struggle with that. So, listen, here's kind of the rules of it. Now, we've got kind of a modified feel here, right, at the nation's capital. So, you can't hit it over the fence and right. You can't hit it off the top of the building. There are 11 new kids here. But the uh, – so, the runners, like this situation here, we've got a runner on second. The runners can when – the, when the ball's tossed up, they can get their secondary, okay? And so – you know, it really creates situations where you get double play situations, which, you know, from really from 12 you down, I mean, there's not a whole lot of times that happens with, you know, the amount of times hit or steal. But anyway, so they're tossing it up, they're hitting, and, and really what we're trying to do is like this particular situation right here, third baseman can't come up with it. All right, so we're looking for a cutoff situation. Okay, and so you can see here, now he's a little late on it, but the third baseman kind of comes in or comes back, and he's the cutoff right here. You got the shortstop moving over to cover third right here, okay? And so that you know that's been one of the things we've really tried to instill is is where you need to be in certain situations. And and look, it's tough in a scrimmage because you might run into a scrimmage where you never you never have these situations. But in this uh, this fungo ball here, we get a lot of them. Uh, so it's a really effective practice. Now, this, uh, and you can see here, you know, some hitters have trouble, you know, hitting fungos. You see him getting around that a little bit there. Um, you know, double cut situations happen quite a bit with this. And so this ball's hit over the left fielder's head. And it's headed for the parking lot right there. But what you can see here is you got the shortstop going out. Should have the second baseman. Following him here, a little double cut situation. All right, so we're trying to get these guys to have, you know, to to have high level movement on the field and, and get them a lot of reps with it. So the uh, and, and you should also see, you know, on this. Let's check if he's there. So the first baseman needs needs to trail this play right here, which he's doing. So listen, it, it gets you a lot of reps and. Uh, I think it's a really effective way to uh, to run a uh, kind of a modified scrimmage. So, anyway, hey, for if you have questions, coaches out there, questions about practice setup, um, how to run an effective practice, hey, don't don't hesitate to send us a message. You can send it to John at linedrivenation dot com or reach out to us on Facebook. But uh, this is a pretty cool. Hey, the kids love it. They 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 want to play this all the time, and uh, you know anything that they're excited about. I'm excited about. So anyway, appreciate you watching. Hey, and uh, let us know if we can help in any way.